Hi, I'm uh, Henny Walgren with Henny Group, and today I'm going to show you our newest holster hanger. As of today, we have three different holsters, hangers that we make. We have the T1000 that we introduced uh, almost a year ago. We have the T800, which we uh, explained in a separate video. And now I'm going to show you the TX, which is our newest, neatest, smallest, and pretty cool little hanger. So this one here is uh, very compact just compared to the T800. It's um, massively uh, slimmer. So the, the reason I actually made this one is my wife, she needed a holster, she can get a gun close enough to the body to shoot IPSC. And uh, she was using the T1000, worked great. And then I was like, oh, I'll make a T800. And even that one wasn't close enough. So we made this one, which is a TX. And um, let me show you here. So some of the adjustability we have in this, it's less, of course, than you have on the other two. We call this a two and a half levels adjustment. You have the regular uh, caster adjustment. You have your camber adjustment. And you have technically two levels of so height adjustment, you could say. You have, this is a typical low one. You can also flip and mount it upside down and they'll mount it one inch higher. So if you look at the, what I have mounted here on my body. This is DWX and you can see it's it's made to be, you know, safe height. It's low, but it's still gonna be make sure it's legal. And uh, I have set it up it's very comfortable. It's way closer. So she has no problem at all getting within you know, distance to uh, IPSC. It's, it's the same type of um, plate, T plate we call them. It just looks different, but it's the same Hole patterns so you have the blade tech you have the g-code and you have the black hawk so the most common um, kydex holsters can be mounted to it so you can see here I can I can still do my scoop draw now I don't have the ability to to tow it out exactly where I want it but I get my I can get it to just straight up and down which one I want with my camber adjustment and I can do my caster adjustment I said as low, so height-wise, you know, you only have two adjustments, but for most people, this will work great. I can still do my scoop drum, but you know, obviously there's, you know, differences between all these things. If I want the perfect adjustable hanger, I'm going to do a T1000. If I want to do, you know, slightly closer to my body, not as picky about having the camber, I can do a T800, and in this one, we have the camber but not the toe and if I wanted to I could again I could use little spacers to try to angle it out the way I want it so with some adjustability you can work on your own you can make it work but it's a great really compact really nice hanger and for a lot of people this would be absolutely perfect so you can say again here you know you can see I took the one screw out so I can I can flip it, but there's a third or a second screw that goes in there. So this is the you know the most common adjustable thing people use. But this is where you don't get in. I don't think any other really hangers out there. <clears throat> you get your camber adjustment, which is super nice, right? Because you get that gun adjusted just the way you want it. And like I said, if this is uh, too low for you or something, you can flip it and get it one inch higher. So a limited height adjustment, but probably good enough for. For most people what they're looking for and uh, also our least expensive hanger too so it's a great option for a lot of people and um, i've shot it in competitions already and it, I, I like it um, of course i will go back to my t1000 but uh, this is I'll, I'll probably mount several guns on this one just because it works so but again if you want the full adjustability t1000 Somewhere between a T800 and um, TX for great little hanger. That's it.